I don't, I don't know, because Lowen didn't play, period. He actually just got purely floated like Maloney should have. Well, no, the thing is, it's also a 48-man well, bracket. Maloney was floated. No, it, you have to remember, it's also a 48-man bracket, so there's... Yeah, but what I'm saying, like, Maloney should have been floated, too, because he was number two in points. He, he was. He just didn't get a bye. He had to face someone round one. I think I kind of get what you're saying. It's, he was not safe. in pools. But, okay. That may, okay, I got it. All right, we, well, we got the set here. Um, we got Maloney versus Nam. Heartbreaking because they are static doubles partners facing round two of winners. Let's see if uh, Nam get an early gimp on Maloney. After that, like, 70% mark, though, it's going to be a bit harder to actually get a, you know, weak hit gimp kind of thing that she yeah. normally gets against Cloud. I mean, even hard hitting gimps are favorable, too, because if Nam could just keep Maloney off for a long part of this, the uh, match, that will wind down the clock. Nam normally doesn't try and go for time, but sometimes you just got to, if you're just keeping the person off stage for, like, two minutes. Uh, it's definitely, like, I forgot where I saw this from, but they were explaining that after a certain while, Cloud just keeps drifting, and at that point, you just got to edge guard. Yeah. Like, actually edge guard. Oh, that Ooh. reached. That such a long bouncing fish. Oh, trying to two frame there. If you would have gotten that, that two frame down tilt, you likely would have gotten something out of it. Yeah, he probably went for like a uh, up smash or another bouncing fish. Yeah. Okay. This is side B Ooh. when Nam's approaching. Yeah, Nam was trying to do like a dash back, dash in. Kind of get Maloney to do something that creatively. It? it is. That, that was a nice conversion, but uh, Maloney just waited until Nam dashed back in and knew that he could keep him out because he was stuck in his dash. Yeah. All right, let's see how much early percent Nam can get. Ooh. Or will he die to up air because he tries overextending? Yeah. I'm actually surprised Nam agreed to uh, Town City for game one. Yeah, I, just, I feel like I wouldn't really see Nam killing off the top as early, but then again, you did get an up air kill at before 1.30, which is amazing in itself. Oh, is that the stock? That's the stock. Yeah, that should be the stock. Jeez, Nam just kind of ran a clinic all over the line. Yeah, I'm pretty sure even if he air dodged to that bouncing fish, it would just frame trap into a different hit. Yeah. So either Nam's going to ban triplets or Maloney's going to take him to triplets. If he doesn't get triplets, I would assume he'd just go back to town city. Um, hmm. I wouldn't be surprised. He could also go to Lilat. That's true. Yeah, because I've heard the Cloud's like going there for uh, yeah, to boost their aggression. Even though Maloney seems to be a bit more passive, so he may opt for definitely not Smash or FTC. Yeah, yeah, going back to Town City. Uh, yeah, Lilan. Triplash are banned, probably. Town City seem like the only two options I would expect out of Maloney if Triplash are banned. So, game two, what one thing Nam was doing that probably attributed to a lot was that when Maloney wasn't near him, he was needle camping the crap out of him. Yeah, yeah. Getting those little pecs are definitely super important. Oh, pressure and Maloney get another grab there. Ooh, I'm actually surprised that he didn't just go for fair immediately as soon as Maloney air dodge. But I'm not sure if he had the time. Probably not. Uh oh. Good jump. Getting out of that situation. Oh. Still taking percent, but at least he's back on stage. I mean, that's the first percent Nam's taking. So he's not in like the worst possible situation. Yeah. Maloney trying to go for a uh, early kill by getting the falling uh, up air into the down B. Uh, yeah, he can definitely, he can probably start doing that now. But he might want to save limits so he can get that stat boost and kind of compete more sheet speed. <gasps> Ooh. That's terrible. Missing the grab. Oh. Nom. He wanted Nam to try and whiff punish him. And he didn't even need to whiff. Nam just jumped into it. Maloney already had an option open. Yeah, that up air definitely... Uh, I'm assuming it was a bait. Oh that was a goodness. really good one at that. That was a very good read. Who's yes, the Nam classic. Jump read, bouncing fish. I mean, he went all the way out there. He, they were both blast zone when he got him. Yeah, I mean, that was, he did go super deep for that. Well, not deep, but like, you know, went as far as he could. Well, and always getting the uh, auto snaps up B by just the very start of it. Yeah, auto, the auto snap up B. I, if Cloud didn't have that, his recovery 
It, it would be too painful. Ooh, getting the two frame down air, I mean down tilt, but not quite being able to punish it the second time. Oh, uh, it's looking really rough for Maloney here. Let's see if he can uh, turn, reverse the situation like he did oh, wow. the first stock. Yeah, he definitely brought it back. He was, oh, nice percent. Yeah, he doesn't need too much percent of cheek before he can start killing her. But Nam, what he has to do is he has to keep Maloney off stage as much as possible and try to get his setups. Oh, the air dodge Ooh. landed on the platform. He's got he's to place a B now. I mean, he got some damage out of this. I guess it wasn't bad by his voice. Nam unshielding, expecting to stop that after the second one. Nobody ever expects a smash like this. Uh oh, Nam's getting a little flustered, I think. Letting Maloney get away with way too much stuff. Yeah, that get up attack right there. I'm surprised that Malone, he didn't get back here for it. That would have been super rough, because Nam get up attack twice in a row, I'm assuming. The second one was by accident. Possibly. Oh my lord, narrowly avoiding that. It's oh. like the Matrix, dog, that. This is coming really down to the wire on this game, too. Oh my goodness. Oh, I almost saw Nam vanish. I mean, almost, but oh, that's it. Yeah, that pair was definitely going to take it. Now it's going to game three. Maloney probably going to go into this game with momentum. Nam might be tilted, but he might compose himself and bring I back. I think Nam's in a very good spot because, honestly, he died because he got uh, impatient and ran to a side B the first time. And that time he died because he got up almost immediately after the edge, and Maloney just threw out a yeah. forward air. So. Yeah, he was getting up a bit too quick, quickly. He was putting himself in the ledge uh, a bit too often, too. Like, a bunch of times where he tried going for something, it put him at the ledge and then gave Maloney stage control, which in this matchup just seems super devastating if you give Cloud stage control and he has the power to kill you at that percent. Yeah. Uh-oh. Ooh, Maloney messing up the, the up tilt and up air combos. Okay. Ron Sheikville, so anything could happen Ooh. now. That, that, that nice dash dance. That was beautiful. He didn't get any dumpy, but it did look pretty. Microspacing. That's that's what I figured. At that moment, he like, I think Maloney went for something, and then he kind of just dashed away from it for a moment. Okay. Oh. See, being able to do like bouncing fish out of your opponent's range—that's so good. I wish I had characters like that. Yeah, I wish I I could uh, have good tools to kill too. You're you're, weak. you're joking. All right. It's just... Anyways. This, this is a very typical situation that we've seen in all the shadows games. things like that, you know, you <laughs> uh, They're usually around these percents, and then we see like a reversal from either one of them in terms of like the situation where it, whether or not Maloney has Nam the ledge or the other way around. Yeah, Nam probably just needs to really get Maloney's limit offline, force him to use it off stage. Oh my goodness, that is like a skill. Yeah, that, he has to be careful with that shield. Now, a bunch of things should shield poke if Nam doesn't let that shield grow. Well, yeah, his shield's grown back now. Oh. Oh, unfortunate. Held onto the stage just a moment too long and getting hit by the uh, vanish. Yeah, I. it's kind of hard if you're not expecting it. Uh, it's kind of hard to time the tech. And I think Maloney probably tried doing something to get off the ledge. Or he likely was trying to do like drop down, double jump there to try to two frame it. You know, there's a bunch of possibilities. Yeah, there, there are. But right now, the possibility of Nam winning is, say, about 80%, 90%. Oh, oh no. no. Definitely miss input there. Yeah, it's unfortunate. So once again, Nam two stock and Maloney to win. Yeah, that could have been a different game, though, if. Uh, Maloney was able to get back to the stage. I've definitely seen M Maloney 